Most Christian believers have a salvation illusion. They believe they are saved. Many have gone through certain practices. They've said a sinner's prayer. Some have been baptized in water. Others have even received the baptism of the Holy Spirit and they speak in tongues. And they believe that because they once received the gift of the Holy Spirit and that they can still speak in tongues, that they are saved, that that is a guarantee of salvation. But they have no relationship with Jesus Christ. Many believe that because they belong to a church and because they were christened or baptized as babies and because they comply to the church doctrine that they have salvation, they are safe. That's an illusion. They don't have a relationship with Jesus Christ. Many others have even gone into ministry become pastors, priests, clergy, and they practice religion. They themselves are under salvation illusion, and they are deluding others, making them believe that if they follow certain practices, that they are saved. Jesus spoke about a Pharisee that prayed in the temple, and said, Lord, I thank thee that I'm not like this money collector next to me. He thought that through his prayers and through his religious devotion, he was saved. He was not. Jesus said that many will stand before him and say, Lord, Lord, in your name I cast out demons. And I did many things, many powers. And he will say to them, go away, I never knew you. Many people spend hours praying, spend hours reading their Bibles. They are busy with a self-paced, self-regulated, self-imposed religion. But they have no relationship with Jesus because they do not hear from Him. They do not have His Spirit. Some have His Spirit, but they don't listen to His Spirit. They are busy with their own form of godliness. They are under salvation illusion. Many spend their lives working for the church. And as they say, working for God. But they do it in their own way. They do not hear from Jesus. They do not wait on Him. They do not know His voice. They do not obey Him, nor follow Him. They are busy with religion. And they are under salvation illusion. If you do not hear from Jesus, and if He does not confirm to you whether He is pleased with you, then you are under salvation illusion. You need to go on your knees and cry out to Him, seek Him with all your heart, until He speaks to you. Seek Him until you know that you are right with Him. Not that you were right with Him 10 years ago, or 20 years ago, or you received the Holy Spirit 20 years ago. If you do not hear from Him every day, if you are not in close relationship with Him daily, you're not following Him and you are under salvation illusion. You need to know where you stand with the living God. You need to know every moment whether your relationship with Him is real and whether He is pleased with you. Don't leave it to anybody else. Don't leave it to chance. Don't live under illusion. Go on your knees and cry out to Jesus. Seek Him until you know. And then stay with Him. Keep seeking Him. 
and always know where you stand with the living God or else you are under salvation illusion. May Jesus bless you.